It is really late. I should probably get to bed. It's like 2 a.m. right now. I don't know what I'm doing. I really don't know what I'm doing. I've just been sitting around. I was working on videos earlier and I've just been sitting around the past hour or two. So with that being said, I'm waking up at 5 o'clock. 5 o'clock. Driving to Savannah. I'm gonna be signing on my house. I'm very excited. But I need to get some rest. I'll catch you guys in the morning. Well, I was probably the hardest I've ever had to get up. I nearly went to bed at like 3, but I got back from the gym like near 11. Now I've already been exhausted and it's like 5.30 right now. Now I've got to drive 5 hours. So paperwork to drive five hours back. Mm. It's gonna be an interesting day, boys and girls. Before anything, my dad's still in the shower and everything, so my grandpa just got here. He's actually coming with us because he's signing on the house. He's gonna be on the, his name's gonna be under the house as well. So I'm gonna go up to, I'm gonna go grab some gas, I'm out of gas. And I'm also gonna grab some McDonald's because I'm stuck, I don't know why. But this is just bizarre, like, I just ate before I went to bed, and now I'm, like, starving. Starving. Then again, I'm, like, bloated. I don't know. I mean, look at me. It's crazy. It's going to be an interesting trip. We got McDonald's. We got gas. We're ready to get on the road. Finally, I can move how I want it. I need pick the top and I'm zoning. You got me, I got you, and it's all that I need when I wake in the morning. All right, guys, so we've been on the road for about, I'd say, two hours now. Hit no traffic through Atlanta. It's perfect. You know, for my house, you know, I live in Gwinnett County, uh, Buford, Georgia. Going to Savannah right now. Stop pilot gas station. There's a dad behind me. I got a piss so bad. We should be good. We, uh, we only have an hour and 30 minutes left, so that's great. Gonna meet the real realtor at 11. It's 9 o'clock right now. Closing on the house. Pretty good timing. Closing on the house. Everything's gonna be done. It's gonna be good. Get a few things done while we're there. And uh, an original. Look at that. It's crushed up. Dang, USB. Alright, I'm pumping gas right now. I gotta take it. I gotta go to the bathroom. I gotta go. So, guys, just stopped by the gas station. Uh, pulled up. Got some beef jerky. This, you know, like how you normally get like Jacklin's or something? I, I've been getting this World Kitchens beef jerky. I've never tried the pepper. I've just tried the original. It's freaking amazing. Like, it's like Jacklin's on steroids. It's so much better. Get more bang for your buck, too. I don't know. Go try it out. If you guys like beef jerky. I promise you that stuff's like way better than any other beef jerky I've tried. That store bought, you know. We're gonna keep on hustling. Hour and 30 more minutes. Let's go. Hey, you got, look, you got Craig Myrtles out here, Noah. Where? You know what we need oh, to yeah, do? Oh, yeah, that is well, You know what we need to do? Well, okay. What the hell? Uh, no Happy closing day. Thank you. How are you, you doing? Good, good. How you been? Congratulations. Let me grab all my tools. Are we videoing? Everything and then my own little world and then this mm. guy just comes beating on the door. Hey. Hello there. Good to see you. Good to see you again. Welcome back. Yeah. It was actually pretty easy. Yeah, it was nice. You see me right here, Steve. Next year, we need to cut them off. Come on in. Yeah. 
The AC is on. It was weird. Nothing. Oh, nice. Nothing, right? <laughs> it's better with no furniture in here. Yeah, it looks yeah. clean, too. Make it clean. They, he was oh, here. I came out here Wednesday. He was a lot bigger. Scrubbing and everything. Look at this. Look at this. Everything you need, key wise, all laid out. He's labeled everything. Finally, I can move how I want it. I need pick the top and I'm zoning. You got me, I got you, and it's all that I need when I wake in the morning. For who I love. That is awesome. We got to run out of town for like a week, but then we'll be back moving him in. The neighborhood knows. <laughs> Celebrity moving in. Say hello to the camera. We'll put you on. <laughs> All right, guys. So, as you can tell, some of the walls got, you know, some wear and tear. And you know we're gonna have all this repainted, but I'll I'll show I'll, here, I'll show you like a little quick tour of everything. So they actually left this. They're nice enough to leave this. This is gonna be like a little office area. Um, this room would be for my dad. This room would be for me. And this room would be for my dogs. I'm totally kidding. But seriously, this would be office. Spare room. This is a second bathroom. Whatever you want to say, first bathroom. This is a bath. Towel area. This room, definitely kind of repainted. Unless I want to come move in this purple room. But, uh. Got a mirror. I swear I got a mirror in every room. Closet. This room needs to be repainted, like I said. It's another spare room. One of these rooms are going to have spare bed and stuff so if I have my parents or grandparents come over that they'll be able to stay in one of these rooms like I said they gave us this store stuff in that this is the master this is where I'll be living as you can tell wear and tear I'm gonna have all this repainted and done especially I mean this wall it's like white that's a big reason why it's all dirty bathroom Closet. This was awesome. It's great. I'm very excited about that. that was weird. I don't wow. I'm very excited about this. The whole upstairs. But they the the whole like thing with like the blue and the purple room and stuff like that. Like this blue room. They had they had a boy. He stayed in here. Purple room. They had a little girl. She stayed in there. Then they had another kid. But I'm guessing it just stayed. I mean, he's young. Then that was their old room. Yeah, they were nice enough to give us this. It's definitely good storage, you know, put camera stuff, put whatever I want. They left. And uh, yeah, I told them I'm moving in this room. Not the room. <laughs> it needs to be touched up. Also, this oh, look. Yeah. See this? The windows need to be fixed. I don't, know. I don't know what causes that. That needs to be fixed, so. I mean, I saw that one where. This one's, this one's fine, though. I don't know. You know what causes that? What causes that to the window? Chimney. Living room. Stairs, outdoor, uh, front door. I would say outdoor. Here's a little closet I was actually in here. We got shelves. Bathroom. This bathroom is actually in really very, there's a lot, very great condition. And you got like the dining room, which is attached to the kitchen, which leads, and then you got this little patio, outdoor patio. So uh, this is a screened in patio. It's got the yard. This is gonna be awesome, you know, like grill out, eat, do my homework, edit videos, 
all that good stuff. Pantry, washer and dryer. Then there's a small garage. Very small. There's a lot. Very, very small. I can barely fit a Honda Civic in here. Like, yeah. I don't even think you could fit. I'm not gonna be able to fit anything in here anyways because I'm actually gonna put some like fish in tech. I'm not gonna keep it like crammed, don't don't get me wrong, because I'm not gonna like throw stuff everywhere. That's not how I wanna do things. But I will keep it semi-organized. It's gonna have stuff along the edge. But you won't be able to park a car in here whatsoever. Hey guys, you know, I came to this house, you know, I'm checking out the house and everything. There's there actually some kids in the neighborhood that watch my videos. You know, they're actually fishing across over there. I guess you guys live somewhere over there. And they're fishing in their little kayaks and uh, they wanted to say something. You want to say anything? Yeah. Shout out or anything? Um, my friend lived down the road and um, when he said that YouTube was moving in, we um, were excited and we looked you up and it was exciting. Um, we started watching you, subscribe, like your videos. It was just awesome to watch. I can love watching the videos. Is as your top watch it videos. <laughs> See, that's awesome, guys. That's what I live for. Everything. You know, I'm sure I'll be filming with these guys. You know, soon, probably this year, we'll probably do something or come out here fishing. We'll go do something fun. But that's great. You'll be seeing them on the vlog. That's, that sounds nice. Those two are nice. That's like something darker. When you have something lighter, you know, it's, got, it's just tears up. I love these kind of colors. You like light like that? Tear up so easy, little huh? one. Got some paints picked out. You know, obviously, we got to paint that purple room that I really want. And that blue one as well. It's a little bit of touch up stuff, so we're looking at paint, figuring out what to do. Figuring out what colors. We're not buying it right now, though. We're just looking. For it. Now we're going to look. Some patio furniture. Yeah, no one's trying to steal something. Here's the buzzer going off. We're going to get back to the part or part. I don't think I have to call it an apartment anymore. I'm about to get back to the house and figure out what color we need to use. Whatever we gotta do. Now we're trying to find patio furniture though. You know, there's like a seat outside, there's like an outdoor. A like waterproof couchish thing that was on, on the back patio. So now that's what we need to look for. That's what we need. Every single person in the store is looking at me like I'm crazy holding a camera talking to them. You know? I really don't care. It's the time we've been waiting for. Just parked. I don't like where I parked, but I'm gonna go with it. Because I don't really have a choice right now. But we're about to walk to the signing right now. Hey, seriously, I gotta go get one. Get a picture of me with your son, so. I get lots of clients. <laughs> lots of 17 year olds that want to buy houses. There you go. That's a perfect picture. Yeah, yeah. Do, the, Look at the, that do the effect. Do that. I gotta go buy the phone right now. Yeah, look at that. Um, it's insane. Yeah, it's kind of weird when you walk out and realize I can't get back in now. It's not mine. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm excited for you, buddy. Oh, dude, I'm so burning as crap. <laughs> What's going on, guys? Just got home. <clears throat> It's like there's a tornado about to happen or something. Today was an amazing day. I'm overly exhausted. I mean, exhausted to the point. I made that clip in the morning at, I believe, like 2 a.m. I ended up going to bed till 3.30. Uh, I just couldn't go to sleep, and so I stayed on my computer. Woke up at 5, drove to Savannah, signed on the house, went to Hood Depot, um, got lunch, Drove all the way back. Like I've been on like a 10 hour drive today with like zero sleep. And today was just so crazy. And 
you know, it was absolutely amazing, you know, today. I, I just like to thank everyone who supports me, um, you know, parents, my realtor, uh, my grandparents, especially, and uh, everyone who helped me and, uh, you know, helped me out with this and made this happen. You know, this is my big opportunity and, um, you know, first step into the big world, first step in the life, you know, just got my first house ever. And it was just such a great experience to actually get to vlog this and actually get to document this and, you know, get to watch this, you know, 30 years from now and be like, you know, this is my first house, you know, it happened this way. You know, I videoed the whole thing. Sadly, on the whole signing deal with a lawyer and everything, and just everyone, um, people who owned the house before, I didn't film in there just because that was kind of something that I probably shouldn't bring the camera out, but I did film after. I believe my dad got a picture of me throw that up during the video. Um, but overall, guys, thank you guys so much for the support. You know, I want to be here where I'm at today without you guys. And that's just something that's just straight up facts. I really wouldn't be where I'm at right now. I wouldn't be as successful as I've been the past five years of owning my business. And I wouldn't be anywhere near I'm at, where I'm at right now if it wasn't for you guys. Because you guys support me so much. You watch my videos. You know, uh, I got the sponsors I have now because of you guys. Um, I'm getting paid because of you guys. Um, you know, sponsors are paying me because of you guys. You know, my whole brand, t-shirt, clothing line, because of you guys, everything, and why, why I'm living such a successful life right now is because of you guys, and I can't stress that enough, and I just like to thank you guys, but first big step in a life today, and I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog, I just wanted to document it, because I know you guys would love to see it, but so thankful for this, but thank you guys so much for watching, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to hit the thumbs up button, I'm beyond exhausted, so I'm going to be going to sleep, my face is like all red, I don't even know what's going on. It's not good. I was like falling asleep driving. I chewed a whole bag of sunflower seeds. It was chaotic. It was crazy. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, please hit the thumbs up button. Be sure to leave a comment below. Also, be sure to subscribe and hit the little bell. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Honestly, I think that 24-7 an understatement to my day-to-day. -day. If ain't no way, then I'ma make a way. Yeah. They say I say it ain't no way. I ain't never listened, kept them at a distance. This is for the ones who ain't afraid. And this is more than some paper chase. I wonder who else can say the same. Never worry about what they attain. If I'm living, then I really can't complain. Can't contain who you really are. I know my true colors like the same.